Okay, guys, if you are still in chat, please tell me if you can hear some uh, some random person now. So uh, yeah. Let's try that again. Okay, the audio is gonna loop because I'm gonna listen into uh, listen in myself. Give me a second. I'm gonna listen into uh, listen in myself. Give me a second. Very nice. Okay. Very nice. Okay. Yeah, now they can hear you. Perfect. They can, I, they, they can hear you now. That's good. There we go. Okay, now we actually have a proper Pococa. So that which means we are gonna go to over here, and we'll see you in a couple minutes. See the club bounce. Club bounce. Into a club and you see these fine suits and you say to yourself, 
God damn, I'm surrounded by players. You're not. You're not surrounded by anything else than cotton and silk filled up with assholes who think they're somebody. But they're not. Because you can always spot a player by one thing. The drink in his hand. You know what I'm talking about? I'm talking about a first class alcoholic. See the club bounce. And we're back, and this time with an oh. actual co-host. Whoa! Spin is live. Okay. Spin is live. Okay. We got Klaus Sergio Strandberg with the sniper rifle as a military officer, and raises a dan as with an electrocution as the bodyguard. Wow. Okay, that are very very good uh, conditions to be honest. Yeah, and that's. Um. Huh. To be fair, those are really easy. Like, military officer, you can easily get the disguise if you start with Rise of Dan and uh, with the electrocution, you can just pretty much take the phone. That's bodyguard disguise. Is that one by the uh, club place? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I would also start in the Shisha bar. No. Yeah, but let's see where they go from there. Uh, Frisbee is either afk or he's just thinking about what he's gonna take with him uh and the thing is i am actually gonna give the audio to him because we only had audio from uh fopper wait why am i moving this i kind of just want to move the sound i can thank you very much there we go i really need to set up that this can be set up a tad better but okay so must be the red hat. Papa meter. already going in. Me and my bound is still thinking about where to start. Must be the red hat military officer. Okay. So I'm just gonna uh take that and write both of them that. Okay. So if we're already going in. You can Start pretty much already compound. take that disguise from that guy. He, I think he is a red head officer, but I'm not sure. And for a fact that this one is. Like right here. Uh, I think it's with sniper rifle. Do you actually need to shoot with the sniper rifle or does a chandelier count? I think you have to shoot with the uh, sniper rifle. Okay, gotcha. Both started in the military compound, going for the officer uh, disguise at first. Which is interesting because I'd rather just go for the bodyguard outfit first, then go in, kill Razor Dan with an electrocution and grab just grabbing the military officer disguise and then just go for Klaus Hugo Sandberg. Yeah. Especially considering that the electrocution accident is like um the easiest out of all of them that can exist. They might actually just uh Drop the phone for uh, Razor and then run away. Change into the bodyguard disguise later and. Uh... That is a very good idea, right? You can do that. Obviously, like you can just take the red hat disguise, give him the phone, 
and then just straight up go uh, go out, uh, kill Strandberg, then get the bodyguard disguise, press that one button and go out. And that also the thing is, this is not gonna be a 15 or 20 minute contract, this is gonna be like a 3 minute, maybe 5 minute? Yeah. I already think, thinking about it, this can be done in like, I think like a couple minutes even. Depending on how you take out uh, Klaus with the sniper. Yeah, that's true. Like if you go in and do like knock him out and go for the e if rather e easy headshot or if you go for a risky outside headshot and hope they won't find the body. Which no. can be done to be honest, but it's um, not simple. It can be done, yeah. The could the also technically uh, could also knock out everyone in the tunnel and do it there. True, that's true. But that would require to uh, call him from the military compound. You could also panic him. Technically, he will go into his room, and then you can shoot him right there. But I'm not sure if any guards will be present with him. Yeah, the, that's true. The glass isn't bulletproof, so you can't shoot through it. Fopper is pro is going for the inside kill. You're in. Good work. The, the, the way it looks. Yeah, that's probably what I would have done too. Yeah, it's um the safe method in a sense. No. I wouldn't really say safe because it is it actually isn't that safe, but you it's simpler. Depending on. Uh, where you take them out, it can be safe. Yeah, that's true. Keep in mind, there is a camera right here, so don't get spotted by that one. But I think you can even go upstairs with that disguise, but I am not sure. No, I, I think upstairs is trespassing. Actually. Okay. Oh yeah, that's right, true, they cannot go upstairs. Oh, you can't go upstairs. They, obviously they can because, well, restrictions don't apply to them. No. Okay, destroying the cameras. It's a good call. And yes, you are indeed trespassing, but that is fine. That is fine. If you like, you can technically lock, knock out both of them and easily go for the kill. Yeah, that's good. You just go in, knock out the one guy, kill the other. There is a security guard that coming will in to come the back in, but he takes his time. Zaydan. Okay, that is really risky. What are you doing? Okay, so he's gonna go get him. No, he or he's not because he doesn't like moving. Um, what you also can do is pretty much um, wait for him to go into the uh, meeting room and then just kill him in the meeting room. Yeah. That's probably what I would do, or like what I just said earlier, run in, knock out the guy, shoot them, then drag both of them uh, where they won't get spotted, wait for the police guy to come and knock him out as well, and then you're good to go. Freeze is still running around in the military compound, seems like he restarted. Yeah, he has restarted like three times at this point. So he's still trying to figure out... Um, what to do from now on? No. How to get the officer disguise? Meanwhile, Adoria and Dribble are currently in the decider match. Yep. I think the Swagger is in which Super would... risky, what are you doing? Okay, he's going for the phone, what we were talking about earlier. It's just in, risky in the sense that another guy can pick it up, but on the other hand, well... Hmm. <laughs> I, lo I love the fact that you can just dismiss them. No. <laughs> um. 
Okay, he's going for the phone. So that's good. So now you uh, pretty much have him killed. That's pretty much. Well, unless you're not yeah, unless you're not getting spotted while you get in the bodyguard disguise, but well that's what it kind of assumes. No. Um... Uh... What is Fop doing right now? That's very risky. What are you doing? Okay, he's okay. He's going back into the meeting room. I mean, you can't knock out that guard that's just patrolling around. He... Yeah, I could knock him out and drag him into the janitor's uh, room there. Okay, he's trying to get the disguise. I don't know what exactly he's planning. Frisbeon, meanwhile, is uh, going for the bodyguard disguise. You will get spotted. Oh, wow, you actually didn't. That can't I fail, by the way. You... I think Fopper is uh, planning on um, luring the luring clogs into that room. Yeah, definitely is. It's a rather, like, that's, the, I'd say that's probably the easiest method right here. He hasn't given the phone to Razor yet. He did not, but well, well, to be fair, you can always just give the phone to Razor. Yeah, but I thought he would do that while he was already in the military compound. Good thing is that he is not an enforcer. So even if he's getting spotted in a sense, he's not getting spotted. No. And can you close it? Perfect, that's it. Now just knock him out. And literally shoot him in the face. And as, uh, I'm, I'm guessing that he brought the... Uh... Oh, oh he my god, oh god, that was unlucky. That was so unlucky. Oh, I, I can feel that. Oh, fuck. Damn. Oh, man. I hate it when that happens. And that's why I actually put, like, different uh, buttons for that. Yeah. Like, for me, like, picking up stuff is F and... Um, uh, and uh, uh, killing someone is Q. Uh, Frisbee also restarted, so they're it was both, pretty uh, much um well, okay, they're both at the same level right now. <laughs> no. I was very unlucky indeed. <laughs> Fopper is luring the uh, officer over. You're dismissed. General Satan's order. I mean, it's um, it's actually like really a good threat from Frisbee and just dismissing all those people. No. So they won't interfere with anything. And now you can just straight up get run out because well, Zayden will pick up the phone. Fopper had a body spotted. Ah, uh, lucky. I'm actually quite interested. The thing is, um, as you're not starting out as a with a, a suit, you cannot bring the sniper rifle with you, so you have to hide it. No. I mean, it, it's not really difficult getting it, so. This map really isn't big.
It also Just... feels a bit bigger with all the like buildings and stuff in between yeah, locations. A, a, that and B, um, you have a lot of the NPCs in here. Yeah. To it, I think it was 3000 something. I did uh, kill them all once. Oh god. Uh, I was bored. And annoyed. <laughs> What are you planning? Okay, so he's probably planning on getting him to the bathroom, I think? I think so. But if you're going for the bathroom, why not just take the seeker with you? And that won't help because people will spot you throwing stuff. Wait, he's actually going for it. I didn't expect, expect that. Yeah, it's because he sees a briefcase on the ground. Oh yeah, that's true. <laughs> he's actually not moving because he can't move there. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, he called someone else over. Okay. And you're in combat because you're not allowed in there. Yeah. So I'd probably take the Seeker with me. You don't really need a pistol here. No. So you can go into the bathroom, shoot him, wait for him to come to the bathroom, and then just literally take his disguise. Fop is trying to give the phone to Razor. Yeah. Let's see if he gets the same idea of dismissing people. Maybe. But uh, you are under stress, so maybe he doesn't think of it. That he can't do that. Doesn't seem like he's uh, thinking about that. Is he... Is he just waiting for Razor to come out? Is Fopper just waiting for Razor to come out again from that room? Yeah. That is risky because I think that guy actually turns around. He could just run into the room and throw the phone, couldn't he? I don't think if you throw the phone that Razor will get it because the main targets usually just send someone else. Yeah, but if they see you throw it, they won't go investigate the throw, but they can still see the phone on the ground. Yeah, that's true. But uh, I think Razor will see the phone now. Yeah, most likely. Yep. Yeah, he okay. does. Why are you still... What are you doing? Just go. You, you've done your part. He has the phone now. You can go get He's the disguise. He's making sure of it. Yeah, true. That's true. Staying inside instinct all the time. I kind of do the same, to be honest. Yeah. You're dismissed. Gen you're dismissed. General Satan. Free space uh, yeah. dismissing people now again. To, now to the like to the uh, hostage. You're dismissed. Okay, so now he did bring the seeker with him. So let's see if he can make that shot happen. I think he can without getting spotted. That's the issue. There is no. a tree in the way, but then that guy will spot you if you shoot from there. Um, and that woman will go into the bathroom, which is a tad annoying, but it can work. 
He could lay a trail of coins all the way to the bathroom. Oh, yeah, but that is more, that is difficult. But yes, you can. Yeah, you could. and time consuming. Why are you trying to get the guard away? You, if do you really want to go inside, you don't need to. That guy has a disguise for you. Hmm. Dude, take the fucking coin. <laughs> <laughs> for us, be telling what it is. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, because uh, well, another NPC just went around and got it for you. For Paris, uh planning on doing the same thing as earlier yeah I mean it did work it's just like uh... yeah the strong you don't next snap the target again. <laughs> yeah well oh yeah just lit literally just do one thing don't put the briefcase right next to his face <laughs> yeah Sorry about that. Come on, man. Oh, come on. What's he doing? <laughs> oh, is he just is gonna he... stand there? Um, I think the guard is in uh, um... you're not allowed to come in mode. Since Freeze is standing so close. Oh, now, okay, now he's moving. Okay, oh, good. Fuck. Yeah. Okay, so he's getting the bodyguard disguise, which means that the first kill will be done in like a second. Meanwhile, Fopper is waiting for uh, Klaus's uh, long cycle. Okay, waiting for Satan to pick up the phone. Satan is dead. That might be a fail. That was like on the millisecond. Right. Yeah, okay, okay. I think we can well. be a tad um, lenient here and say it counts. It. He did get it. He did so get the disguise. He did click it. Uh, Abdom Wallet and Mike or Frody to the side, but I think I, I, I would personally I would let that count. Yeah, I wouldn't be like that much of a dick. Okay, two seconds. Uh, it, it isn't a contract where you can know exactly so. Okay, don't put them like. You don't you have a. What? Why are you doing this, my friend? Okay, this is actually making me mad. Why did you track him? Why not just literally take the sniper rifle and kill him? Fopper, what the, are you doing? Uh, I don't know why I tried to sneak him, but I can just. Oh my god, I'm, I'm sorry that that makes yeah. me mad, but why? The same mistake twice. You made it. How? Just literally you did do the you... same thing again. You did exactly the same thing again, where you put the target right next to the shot to a sniper rifle uh. and just uh, snap the snack instead of literally just the, the, no one will come in there. You can easily take the sniper rifle out and just do what you need to do. Uh, well, okay. Yeah, no scared to the best of us, man. That's true. That's true. Yeah. Okay, now uh, Frisbee Hound is going for the exact same strat. Let's see if Frisbee Hound makes the same mistake as Popper. <laughs> yeah. Frisbee seems to be doing the same thing as Popper. Yeah. 
Yes, yeah, he's doing. Okay, so if Frisbee does not uh, actually like uh, snap the neck of the target as well, that might go to this round. Probably goes to Frisbee, but we'll see. Klaus, you sexy man, hurry up. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna take some time, but Frisbee is in the lead right now. He can afford to wait. Yeah. But he doesn't know that. He, he's most likely not watching his stream here, or he's not allowed to watch my stream. So, let's see. If he panics, or if he doesn't. Four pros and Fabo got spotted. Yep, that's unlucky. Hurry up. That is Klaus Strand. Most wanted man in Morocco. Okay, now taking out the sniper rifle. What are you doing? Just take it. Yep. Okay. <laughs> there we go. Okay. Okay. I was actually was panicking uh... inside right now. <laughs> that was just to exit. Yeah. But why is he taking the janitor disguise? Because Janitor Disguise is not, uh, he can move anywhere. No one, no one will actually, uh, stop him. Yeah, but he just has to exit again and that's a good do in the Officer Disguise. True, but, um, I think he just, look, uh, like, they are both, like, in the, not, not really yeah. in the panic mode, but, uh, yeah, you have true. to keep in mind, he's playing it safe right now, which is a good idea. I yeah. would probably do the same, go for the long run. Like, there are no cameras right now, so he has pretty much won. Let's see which exit he takes. I think he takes the left, yeah. Yeah. Unless he somehow gets spotted or yeah, that's take true. the seeker out in front of everyone or something. That is gonna be a GG this time for Frisbee. So we are gonna have a decider round. Yep. And he has said G oh. or done. So what, what, what? Now he just needs to write done. How'd that end up? He said done, but in the yeah, 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 wrong chat, but I don't think that's really. Yeah, important okay. it, 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 mainly, it, it mainly counts, so... Yeah. Okay, next roll in 8 minutes, so 17.10. It is. 17.10. Yep, correct. So we will go on a short break, and I'll see you guys soon. Surrounded by anything else than cotton and silk, filled up with assholes who think they're somebody, but they're not. Because you can always spot a player by one thing the drink in his hand. You know what I'm talking about? I'm talking about a first class alcoholic. See the club bounce.
walk into a club and you see these fine suits and you say to yourself, God damn, I'm surrounded by players. You're not. You're not surrounded by anything else than cotton and silk filled up with assholes who think they're somebody, but they're not. Because you can always spot a player by one thing, the drink in his hand. You know what I'm talking about? I'm talking about a first class alcoholic. See the club bounce. see these fine suits and you say to yourself god damn i'm surrounded by players you're not you're not surrounded by anything else than cotton and silk filled up with assholes who think they're somebody but they're not because you can always spot a player by one thing the drink in his hand you know what i'm talking about i'm talking about a First class alcoholic. <laughs> I want to see the club bounce. Say to yourself, God damn, I'm surrounded by players. You're not. You're not surrounded by anything else than cotton and silk filled up with assholes who think they're somebody. But they're not. Because you can always spot a player by one thing. The drink in his hand. You know what I'm talking about? I'm talking about a first class alcoholic. See the club bounce. see these fine suits and you say to yourself god damn i'm surrounded by players you're not you're not surrounded by anything else than cotton and silk filled up with assholes who think they're somebody but they're not because you can always spot a player by one thing the drink in his hand you know what i'm talking about i'm talking about a First class alcoholic. <laughs> I want to see the club bounce.
walk into a club and you see these fine suits and you say to yourself, God damn, I'm surrounded by players. You're not. You're not surrounded by anything else than cotton and silk. Okay. And we are back. With the decider match, I still haven't actually edited the score, so I'm gonna do that right now. There we go. Which means that the map will be Paris, and it got decided by Mullet. Okay. So, it seems the restrictions are gonna be Viktor Novikov with an explosion accident as the Sheik. And Dahlia Magolis with an explosive as a weapon suit. So it's gonna be a very explosive kind of conflict today. Oh. Okay. But at the same time, the breach in charge is allowed, so the Dahlia shouldn't be too hard. To be fair, I am really not sure right now if there where I could find a propane tank. As now the uh, um, fire extinguisher doesn't kill anymore. Isn't also there propane in the small uh, shack in the back right of the map? I think there is. And that's kind, kind of good because you do need to get a chic disguise. Uh, there are six propane flasks. Two in the kitchen, actually. Um, technically. Two downstairs oh, wait, no, in you, the you basement too. I was just about to think you can get both of them at the same time by causing them to by both of them to panic, getting them into the panic room, then exploding in there. The thing is, you need two disguises. Now. That is a very good idea. What you're doing right now, my friend. Thing is, um, that body will get found right there. I think he's going to drag it into the room. Yeah. Okay. And that, I think, and I don't, I'm not sure if anyone goes in that room. I don't think so. Um, the shake might be going through there, yeah, but okay. I'm not sure. Well, if you're getting a chic disguise anyway, he won't. So. Um... Yeah, <laughs> that's true. So I'd say probably restart getting uh, something to open that door. And Gordon says the chat near the pier. Yeah, that, that's true. That one has one. Yeah. No. Remote EMP charger. Why? The shed near the pier, the kitchen on the first level, and the basement have uh, propane flasks. Yeah. True. No, my propane. Okay. Um. Oh yeah, the palace key. That's true. You can get that as well. Why are you going for the electrocution phone if you're supposed to explode them? That's a really good question. Like for Dahlia, I'd say you could probably start out killing Dahlia. And then go for Viktor Novikov later on. Yeah, I just realized that uh, two Gordon are right. So you there is no suit at the map as far as I know. Yeah, so you have to start to You might as well just start up there. So you already have your explosives with you. Yeah. And then just uh, going for... Like, you could, you could pretty much lure her uh, when she goes to get a drink. Laura back there, knock her out, then explode her. The thing is, starting up there too makes uh, Dahlia, or if you wait long enough, makes Dahlia go into the bathroom. Would you, uh, 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 would you be able to instantly switch to main uh... junkie myself so if this match ends? They don't have a shotgun, so otherwise they wait until tomorrow. Um, I could technically, no. yes. I. Think I have to eat dinner first, but yeah. Uh, yeah. 
I mean, um, go for dinner, it's fine, I can totally, I mean, I already solo casted one match, so what is another one? Um, yeah, or I mean, uh, sure. If, if, like, I don't know, Mullet, are you still at work? Or I could pretty much ask Mandy, maybe, maybe if Mandy is uh, alive at this point, I think he is. But I should be able to if... Uh... Yeah, yeah, that's fine, I mean, I know, but I'm just gonna quickly see if anyone else could... Um, when does, let me quickly check when the match starts, uh, between Silver. It was supposed to start 15 minutes ago, I think. Oh yeah, it did. Okay. Um, right after, so pretty much, yeah, I can, I can swap, yeah. Okay, um... So yes, for me, I can shoutcast it, um, random person probably needs to go for dinner first yeah i need to go for dinner first but it'll only take like 10 minutes max so really only oh huh. my parents yeah. usually would kill me if i did uh, just take 10 minutes <laughs> yeah so screw them <laughs> i'm just gonna go wait we are where's real love yes no my fa the rest of my family is eating right now so So he went ahead, got her into the room. Now he's just gonna go to explode her, and that's that done. Yep. So, yeah, just take the breacher, put it right under. Her. There we go. Hopefully, it doesn't yeet her out of the window. It doesn't. Good. <laughs> well, that can actually happen. <laughs> So I'll be facing Dribble in my next match. Okay. And Adoria has won the matchup, Fancy. by the way. Yep. Frisbee is now going for the exact same strat. <laughs> no. Yeah, well, it's kind of a safe bet right here. Both know that. Now, only Novikov with... You need to still need your Sheik disguise. <laughs> okay. Sure. <laughs> I'm guessing that so, was your sister. <laughs> uh, no, that was my brother. Oh, your bro... Oh, Jesus Christ. He, he, uh, he's like six years old. Adoria takes the side and moves on. That's perfect. Okay, so I'm guessing Sky will rate me very, very soon. <laughs> so, uh, oh, he just got recorded, but that's still fine, I guess? It should be fine. Yeah, I mean, it's, oh, no, it's he got anymore. spotted now. Okay, well, that's better, but okay. Uh, the match between is PC with with meme junkie and server server. Okay, gotcha. So, yeah, the next match will be here as well. Um, I'm gonna need like like five minutes setup time. Um, but that should be done fairly quick, so I guess it's fine. No. Oh, are you glitching in the wall right now? Oh, you're not. Oh well. That could have that could have been a wall glitch right there. <laughs> okay. There we go. Now first beyond is at the spot where Fopper was just a minute ago.
the where is he going now? I okay here so he's going doing the same thing once more. No. And Frisbee is going for the Sheik disguise, I believe. I mean he could yeah, probably, probably yeah he could take that disguise so he can move around a bit more freely. No. That's what I would do probably. Yeah, he's going for it. No one ever goes in that room. But he's just moving them to a safe spot just in case. You never know. Yeah, that's true. Okay, why are you making it so difficult? You can just literally just activate the clock and he will come. No. Oh. Good question. You will get recorded if you move that way. Oh, or not. Okay. Now, on his way to getting the disguise, um, I don't know, does he have anything to open doors with? I think he has, he has a crowbar with him. Yeah. Okay. Oh, we had a key too. Okay. Uh, yeah, yeah, I mean, the uh, there is like a uh, radio. I think, it, I think it's a clock. Like an alarm clock or anything. Is the I, garden I, starter best? Um... I Depends how we do it. I wouldn't say both of them pretty much had the same strat of going, starting upwards, getting uh, like Dahlia first. Because she is rather simple and you already have to kill her in suit, so that's pretty much done at this point. No. Now both of them just need to get the Sheik disguise and go for the explosion accident. Um, I don't think someone told Fopper that that doesn't kill anymore. Uh. I think he knows it actually. Uh, he probably should, but if he but, doesn't, uh, if he does, the pressure might make him forget. I mean, if he, if he, yeah, that would much very much be the case, I think. And uh, like, uh, that will be a very big bummer if he's not getting the kill. No. The good thing is he's not trespassing in here. So he's just waiting for the sheik to come. That Sheik really doesn't yeah, do anything. Yeah, the Sheik really doesn't like moving. But the thing is, now he has him. No. You can you can go... Oh, okay, he is going for the long run. Oh, damn. And you could pretty much knock him out right there. Yeah. Close. Knock him out. Get the disguise. Or just move him in first. Just to be safe. <laughs> uh, yeah, you could actually do that story mission, but uh, you you have to either distract the guards or KO them, so you can kill them too. You could maybe go for a panic threat, getting men in the panic room, because there you will be alone. One or left of the uh, to that fire extinguisher. <laughs> <laughs> There's one hour left of the IOI store Easter sale. Yeah, true. Indeed. That's a really good sale right now. So if you want to get Hitman 2, if you're interested in the game, you can pick it up the Gold Edition, which means all DLCs, all maps, everything uh, for just 18 bucks, which is really good. Now, yeah. I paid 80 bucks for that. <laughs> If you kill no going its way back, you get the accident kill, he shoot the heater. Okay. Huh. The fi oh he grabbed the print. Okay. See? There we go. No. What's having to think a bit? 
You are not allowed to save once more, but he knows, so... Oh, that might be a big issue now. That thing will explode on the, ne the next time you throw it. No, I think since he picks it up, it resets, doesn't it? Okay, that, that was actually quite a good idea. Now you could call in um, that he will go to his room, but... Uh, oh yeah, why not? Just literally just drop it right there and then shoot it. What did? I mean... Oh, Frisbee has the problem of trying to get the Sheik disguise while he's at the auction. There we go, target lockdown. Are you allowed to go to the helicopter in a Sheik disguise? Uh, shouldn't be too hard to avoid the guards anyways, so... Yeah, I think that's... Oh, you are actually allowed. No, okay. And with that, that is a GG and Fopper wins. A GG to Fopper. We have a winner. Okay. And uh, right. one more GG. And I'm gonna write the recipe. <laughs> Just shot the guy. Yeah. But those were really close matches, to be honest. Like a lot. Yeah, they were. Those. We both could have gotten all three matches multiple times. Mm, that's true. Okay, so this means um, we are we are gonna go offline for a second because I do need to change all the icons and everything else so we can set up for the next match for uh, the, our dear DJ Brownie and Silver Surfer. So yep. we will be right back. Don't worry, uh, it's just gonna take a couple minutes. And I'd say we are gonna start the match at 1740, so in 13 minutes, if that is cool with you all. So, we will be right back.